And that's the ridiculous shit that goes on in the car community on social media. So they talk all this shit about how slow Hellcats are, but then you go through social media and the whole thing is, I beat a Hellcat, I beat a Hellcat, I beat a Hellcat. Y'all act like Hellcats are so goddamn slow, but then you base your whole social media platform about taking your old ass car and souping it up and being able to fucking beat a Hellcat. And just so you know, I ran some numbers because the video says LS3, all it's done to it is a cam. So I ran some numbers. The best upgrade numbers I could find for just a cam on an LS3 is 495 horsepower. So I rounded up to 500 to make your numbers look better. Divide that from the uh, weight of a C6 Corvette and you're looking at roughly 6.8 pounds per horsepower. Meanwhile, you look at the 4,400 pounds from the Hellcat divided by 717 horsepower and you've got 6.1 pounds per horsepower. And just to make it a little more fair, I went with the 707 horsepower cor uh, Hellcat divided from the 4,400 pounds and you've got 6.22 pounds of weight per every one horsepower, which means the C6, even with the cammed upgrade, is heavier. So either you're full of shit, either about beating Hellcats, or you're full of shit about what mods you have done to your car, or you're not really racing with Hellcats, or you're racing jabronis that can't fucking drive. Either way, this is the bullshit that goes on in the car talk community. And everybody goes, oh, well, Mopar fans, all they do is talk shit. It's nonstop. It's nonstop. Hellcat, Hellcat, Hellcat. Y'all y'all are so fucking pressed over these Hellcats. But then you try to act like, oh, I'm such a badass with my car. Y'all are pressed. I don't even have a fucking Hellcat. And my whole fucking feed is Corvettes, Camaros. Ford Mustangs, fucking everything you can think of under the sun. I beat Hellcat today. I beat Hellcat today. If they're not fast, stop using them as the benchmark to talk shit.